All right, so I'm getting ready to laser cut a part for a project I'm working on with my friend Greg. So anyway, here's the laser. I'm getting ready to laser cut a part. Not really supposed to cut with it open, but I want you to be able to see it. This is the bracket that I made up in SolidWorks. Alright, so it's always comes out all black because it's been burnt, but that's the part. So basically this bracket uh, goes right here, connects these two pieces. So here's the final product. This is what I've been working on the last couple of days. This is a joystick mount. This bracket basically goes on the table and blocks it off there. And then this allows you to sit in your chair in the air conditioning and be lazy and fly flight simulators. Anyway. I've been watching Ladrib on his channel. He's got some really good tutorials on how to do some Maddie Stunts style tricks, and I'm gonna try to attempt them today. Um, I haven't done any of these Maddie Stunt style tricks. I can't seem to wrap my head around them, and he does a really good job of explaining them. Hopefully, uh, we can try it out today and get some success. That'd be awesome. I'll start with the reverse split S. I don't know, I think about calling that trick the, uh, the Druid. Drewy flip, that sounds good, right? I think the first thing he said to do was to try to yaw spin under an object and then pitch forward over the object. So I'll try that first. Off to a bad start already. So the idea is that we're supposed to start out by just yawing under the object, getting the feel for it, and then after you're comfortable yawing underneath the object, you're supposed to yaw under it and then pitch forward and go over it. Battery came off. Could be worse. All right, let's try this again. Let's see if I can do a very basic, simple trick without screwing up. So, so I think I got that trick pretty well dialed in, or at least practiced enough to where I can pull it off if I need to. I'm gonna move on to the Maddie Stunts trick, and I think I'm gonna do that a little higher. I might not go under an object, but I think I'm gonna go up to the uh, up to the light poles and do it up there. So that way, if I do make a mistake, I can recover fast enough. All right, so let's see if we can Maddie Stunt. <laughs>
I think that was a successful trip. For my first attempt, I think I did a pretty good job. I wanna give a huge shout out to LaDrib for uh, giving me the inspiration to try these stupid phone. I wanna give a huge shout out to LaDrib for giving us the tutorials that he did. Uh, it made it very easy for me. I just got back from the post office. Got a cool package from ReadyMade RC. Alexa, turn on the store. The Insteon hub has been installed and responding. Ah, figures. Check on the hub. You suck, Alexa. Hey, what up, dude? So Alexa's supposed to turn on all my stuff. I'm supposed to turn on my lights and the air conditioner and all the things around the shop here. But every now and then she screws up. All right, so I got my box of waffles from Ready Made RC. They have this thing where they put a whole bunch of crap in a box and uh, sell it for a really low price. And then you just go through it and see what you get. So let's see what I got. GoPro stuff. I think everybody got one of these. Nano Sky Hunter. This would be nice at the field. A uh, little FPV screen, black pearl. Whole bunch of props that nobody uses anymore. This. Some kind of G10 piece. Nano size video transmitter. Micro camera. Maybe this is for the Sky Hunter. That'd be cool. GoPro car charger. Well, it looks like I got a whole bunch of props and a whole bunch of other stuff. Huge thanks goes out to ReadyMade RC for hooking us up with these awesome toys for low money. Appreciate you guys. Thank you.